Now, though, it's time to find out what's buzzing on the internet. Yes, our favorite Ryan Broderick from BuzzFeed is here to talk about what people are posting, what they're watching, and all the things in between. So good morning, Ryan. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Now, I love this one. You have a son taking advantage of all the snow that we've all been complaining yes. about, and this one is really heartwarming. Yeah, it was. it's a, it's a nice story. So Sharon Hart, uh, she's in a hospital in Chicago uh, getting treatment for leukemia. She opens her window and sees a massive massive uh, note in the snow at the across the street from her right on the parking yeah garage, right? uh, each yeah. letter of this is about two cars long and it mm. says hi mom god bless you they were going to spell out all of you but they ran out of space right, right. Um, and it became this uh, really inspirational photo for everyone at the hospital because they didn't sign it so no one knew who it was for oh. and the chicago tribune tracked down the mom and finally got the whole story i have goosebumps That's from great. that oh, but that. what a thoughtful kid to say yeah. i'm going to do this yeah, for yeah, my mom absolutely yeah. yeah okay somebody posted a picture of their baby and it, it just went crazy yeah. Yes, this is a big lesson for everyone out there. Don't put your baby on the internet because people will turn it into a big joke. Really? Uh, and this oh, is no. a good joke. This is funny. Uh, <laughs> so a uh, family friend, his name is Michael. I tracked him down. He put this picture of a baby on a site called Reddit. And Reddit uh, thought that it looked a lot like a very busy businessman having a morning meeting. So they started putting <laughs> some captions on it. Um, yeah, it's like, <laughs> I'm eating bran after diapers. Tell mom she's fired. Uh, <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yes. Hilarious. This is great. And We're going to have to make some serious changes around here. Let's start with my diaper. Hey, yes. <laughs> Yeah, he's looking for the peekaboo guy. It's What's he want? What's he want? He keeps kidnapping my family and giving them back to me. Oh yes. my gosh. How, how does it. the family feel about it? Uh, so uh, Michael told me that the dad and the baby, whose names they wanted to keep kind of quiet, mm -hmm. are weirded out about it, but uh, they think it's funny. And, yeah. you know, you got to go with the joke Absolutely. at that point. If yeah. the whole internet thinks it's funny, it's tough to fight that. <laughs> as long as the parents aren't all miffed. Yes, right. exactly. All right, well now, a very talented young lady shows us that she loves this movie Frozen, yes, right? Yes, this is incredible. So um, if you don't ever poke around the corners of the internet where people build their own costumes, it's always incredible. And this teenager, Angela from Long Island, she built the most unbelievable outfit from Frozen. Okay. She went as the Snow Queen Elsa. And let's see this. Whoa, she made that herself? Yep. She put it together in her spare time, and on her blog, she details how she put it together, what she did, the makeup tips for it. Good how, long, Lord, how, yeah, how long did it take to do this? She said it was surprisingly easy, but it took her about 250 hours. Oh, my God. That is commitment. Yeah, and she was really worried she wouldn't get a chance to... Uh, to a photo shoot in the snow, and luckily uh, it snowed. Oh yeah, good again. for her. It did. It's gonna snow until July. And she went out there and rocked it. Yeah. How long did it take Disney to sue her? <laughs> no, I'm I kidding. thought they'd just give her that a job. That would be so wrong. Yeah, I think they should. This right. is a beautiful costume. And it's not just Disney. She does all kinds of costumes. Uh, we have a link to her blog on our site to check it out. It's unbelievable. Wow. Maybe a career. Good stuff. Yeah. yeah. All right, uh, let's talk about music careers and one-hit wonders. You've yes. come up with a list of what? Uh, so the streaming music service Spotify uh, listed uh, all of the most streamed one-hit wonders. And there's a whole list of 25, and we can check them out. It's songs like uh, Melt With You, uh, 99 Red Balloons, okay. My Sharona, and it uh, it's ranked in a playlist for anyone to listen to. So we have them all together. Oh, come on, Eileen has to be on there. Yeah, it's on there, it's too. On there too? Oh, it's on there, too? Okay, there. yeah. So we had some favorites on the list. Yeah, what, what were your favorites? I think, well, th I think they're going to play John's first. This is let's not see. a one-hit wonder. This is my anthem. Yes. <laughs> Take let's a see. Listen. Can we play it? 264, my shirt. 264, <laughs> my shirt. So sexy, it hurts. Man, I was not involved in the video. No, no, but you did. Whenever I hear this song, I immediately think of John yes. Elliott. Oh, no, I wake up to the song every morning. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's yeah. Right. What's yours, Carolina? Mine takes me back to, like, my days in high school. I'm, eight, I'm dating myself, but Informer by Snow. And... Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. That used to be my favorite song. It's like we the were... vanilla ice before vanilla ice. Totally, yeah. totally. But I, I mean, who that. let the dogs out? <laughs> no, I mean, it's yeah, on the list. It's on the list. Uh, what I mean, are your favorites? My favorite definitely is Not on Red Balloon. Oh, I love that song. Yeah. It's such a happy little song. I know the American and the German version, so I have They're to. Cool. I, know. <laughs> I used to, for sure. <laughs> This is great. And then you had a couple of other. You can only pick one favorite, Ryan. Right. That, so this that's is going to be this your favorite. My, okay. okay. No, Nine Out of Balloons is my rock out jam. So. What's the, what do you think is the most undeserving one? Ooh, to make the uh, probably 
I was going to say snow, but I feel like it's awkward Really? Now. How dare you? I don't know. No, I, I don't know. I, I don't was wanna... actually between Mercy Playground, Sexy See, Candy. I love Sexy Candy. I love Candy. that song, so song. I couldn't yeah. like say that it was a bad one. Yeah, no, I didn't want to shake yeah. and shake the boat here. Don't get me uh, talking about music. I well, the trick is just go on and check the list out. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And you can subscribe to it and listen to the whole playlist on our site. Will Fantastic. do. Fantastic. Ryan Broderick from BuzzFeed with the new haircut. Thank Looking you so much good, for coming Ryan. and giving us the scoop on what's trending. All the kids are talking about it. Thanks, Ryan. Have a good Thank weekend. You.